The Kane Corso versus the Wolf. Tell us why you think your Corso would win in a one-on-one -on -one battle. While it is possible that a Kane Corso could overcome a Wolf once or twice, the majority of the time, the Wolf would win. Given that Kane Corsos and Wolves are about similar in size and power, you must be wondering why the Wolf would win. The main distinction, though, are wild experience and evolution. Whereas Kane Corsos are primarily domesticated and were undoubtedly used for fighting in the past, they are now merely house dogs. The majority of Wolves survive in the wild and risk their lives every day in order to eat. Unlike canines, wolves are superior at fighting because they have evolved into true predators with the skills necessary to hunt down large prey. Their strength, speed, and fierce attitude have also helped them win clashes. Kane Corsos are nearly the same size as wolves, while some varieties of wolves are larger. When it comes to fighting, one of the most important aspects is size. The taller and heavier you are, the more likely you are to win a fight. Yet size doesn't always matter. We've all seen tigers slaughter camels that are considerably heavier and taller. Kane Corsos are nearly comparable to wolves in this particular case, but they will not be able to defeat them. Sure, a Corso will inflict some harm on a wolf, but in the end, the Corso will be defeated.